So lots of folks are looking for new sources of entertainment from home these days and the library can help you out with that. One of our best resources is RB Digital, which used to be all about audiobooks or recorded books. Um, but these days it also includes some really great resources such as magazines and television shows. Um, and one of those products that they have is Acorn TV. And I know they've been doing a lot of advertising recently um, through other sources and media, but you can access Acorn TV for, for free through your library card. Um, so Acorn is especially attractive to people who love British television. So there's a lot of British TV shows and the occasional Australian or New Zealand TV show. So um, that's a lot of fun. It includes things like Vera and Midsummer Murders and Dead Water Fall Fell. So let's take a look at how you can access this. Um, and I'll show you how to access it on your mobile device. You can access it through a web browser as well, but um, today we're gonna look at it on an Android phone and in how you can cast from your Android to your smart TV through something like Chromecast. So let's get started. In order to access Acorn TV, you're going to look for a product on our webpage called RB Digital, and we're going to find that under Browse, and we're going to look for Movies, TV, and Music. And here we'll find a number of products, and right away, alphabetically, we find Acorn TV, which is great. So we'll click on Acorn, and you'll notice at the top of the screen that it's actually under the umbrella product rbdigital.com. So we're just going to click here to get started for Acorn TV, and you can either create a new account or log in. If you hit create a new account, you're going to be asked for your library card number or barcode, and that is the number that's on your library card without any spaces. Um, but I'm going to click get started and enter my credentials here um, because that's uh, I already have an account set up and I can get started right away. So I'm just logging in and it says welcome back and I'm going to say access Acorn TV which allows me seven days of free access to Acorn. So that is something that you really should keep in mind is that your access is limited to seven days. So every seven days, if you wanna watch something else, you'll need to come back through this process and log in again and get your temporary access to Acorn. So that's the only caveat is that it is only good for seven days, but often there's a period of time in between when you're watching something that you aren't watching. So you can just renew your access whenever you feel like you're ready to watch the next episode of whatever you're watching. So here we are at Acorn TV and so now is where we can just say access Acorn TV and here we are. Now we can see all the different shows that you can watch through your library account. Um, so lots of things here. I'm watching a number of them. I think I've watched a couple of Ms. Fisher's Modern Murder Mysteries, which is a lot of fun. And you can hit the menu and browse. And you can look through different types of things. You can do gritty crime dramas, comedies, foreign language, all kinds of ways for you to explore what you're looking for. Go back into the menu. We can just actually look for a particular title. So let's say you wanted Doc Martin. Oops. And lo and behold, there's Doc Martin. So let's say I want to watch an episode of this. I can add it to my watch list. I can view a trailer. Um, or I could just start looking through the episodes and pick an episode. So let's pick episode five. So I can just watch it on my phone here. Um, or I can also watch it through the app if I've downloaded the app. So I'll show you that in a minute. But here we can just 
hit play. We can maximize it. Turn our So next, let's look at how to access your Acorn movies and television shows on the big screen. So we're going to do that by casting to the TV from the Acorn app. So you'll have had to download the Acorn app onto your device and have some way of casting it to your television, either through Chromecast or through Apple TV. But it's really neat how the app, even though you haven't signed in, um, as a paid consumer into the app, as long as you use the same account information in the app as you do through RB Digital, it should be able to detect that you indeed have access. So here goes. I had previously downloaded the Acorn TV app onto my phone, so I'm gonna open it up here, but you can just go to the Play Store and download it if you have a Google device, an Android device, or you could go to the App Store and download your app there. So I'm gonna to go to Acorn TV, and I'm going to look through here. I think what I'll have to do is, oh, here it is. I have recently watched right there. It knows that I opened up Doc Martin recently. And I'm going to go to, I think we looked, we're looking at this episode, episode five. I'm going to actually say start from the beginning. And it magically knows that I already have access now through the library because I don't pay for this, but I have access. So I can cast to my Chromecast, which I have set up, but if you have a Apple device, you can probably then cast it to your Apple TV, but I'm going to hit here. I'm going to go to cast and I'm going to choose one of the Chromecasts that I have set up um, so that it will show on my smart TV. So I can hit that right there. So here you can see I have cast my Acorn TV uh, from my app to my smart TV using my Chromecast. So hopefully you can get that sorted for yourselves as well and you'll be able to enjoy your Acorn TV on your large screen. I hope you'll all take this opportunity to try out Acorn TV and find some new shows to watch. Please do let us know what you're watching. And um, if you have any questions, just reach out to us at libraryinfo at peterborough.ca and we will get in touch with you and help you out. Have a great day.